My grandfather had a restaurant in Seattle, so, so I came here and I worked for him. People were like coming into my restaurant, were like, where's my chips and salsa? What kind of restaurant you are? There's not been a big spectrum of this kind of cuisine portrayed in the United States. It's, it's very satisfying to do something that is changing the culinary aspect in Seattle from the Mexican point of view. We have two restaurants. We have Asadero in Kent and Asadero in Ballard and they're Mexican steakhouse. We first started the business, I was the one doing all the butchering. And I kind of miss it. I think people from Seattle was really open to uh, new concepts of food. People was looking for something that is just different from the regular Mexican restaurants that we get. And I step up. For me, carne asada has to be grilled. Of course, if you do over natural wood, like wood fire or charcoal, then you're talking the real carne asada. I think the char makes a difference on it. That initial moment when the mesquite charcoal is lighting up, that smell, the crackle from the sparkles of the wood, yeah, that brings childhood memories of uh, family get-togethers. Los ajos, ya sabes cómo. Espérate, mami. Los ajos no. Sí, van crudos. I have the heavy tradition of cooking in my family. I learned to cook from my, my grandmother, my mother, of course, and my wife. It's a little mix. Okay. Esto me dice cuánto, eh? When we came to the U.S., it was really hard to eat the way I used to be eating. So it was kind of a necessity to, to learn. This salsa is pretty typical in the north. It's so simple, but not a lot of people do it, you know? I think it's because of the process, it's a little more artisan. The way we do our food, like we, we do in our house, we do it in, in our restaurant. In a tortilla inflada, esto es lo mejor. Que se infle. We would try to do things the more authentic way. Se me hace muy, muy mexicana, muy rica, muy buena. Que es lo que se necesitaba aquí, en, 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 aquí. Hey, uh, ¿y tienes algo local, güey? Me hicieron, sí, tengo la sección de uh, Double R, son de Yakima, Washington. Ah, uh, it's beautiful, man. Yep, now this is a big boy. Seattle has inspired me on the demand for uh, quality things that people is looking for. Something that I learned here. So it actually pushes more, yeah. you know, to be better. Show me some meats, man, that we can use for uh, the weekend our dry age. For a weekend special? Well, we got plenty. It's always been a treat for us doing tacos out of a high quality meat. So that brings me joy, you know, that that's uh, the joy of the carne asada, the meat. It's... Uh, brings happiness. It brings happiness. <laughs> It's not been easy, uh, even points of uh, that we were about to give up. But we keep it going and I think it paid off. I'm bringing the best part of my family, the best recipes that we got growing up. That's my favorite part of it. I really feel like Seattle is my home. I think I have created a community here. I hope I can push more people to do different things, specialize in what you're doing, and be passionate about it. And don't, don't just try to please the general public with things, but try to be an expert in what you're doing and be different. <laughs>